heard a lot of stories about when the world fell. There were more dead than living, and it started to look like the world would go cold. It felt like it was almost there. Almost. Some people survived by connecting with each other, making found families. Others gave into the darkness. That was a long time ago, and it's now. Will it be tomorrow? We've come so far, lost so much. Did you handcuff my brother to a roof? And you left him there? It's hard to trust when anyone could go at any time. But the people who die and the people who go aren't lost forever. I believe that. I have to. And remembering their voices These people need you. is how we keep them alive. The future belongs to all of us now. Sometimes I wonder if it takes more courage to live or die. Stop! We've all done things to still be here. I have a very important mission. A lie, not a scientist. People died trying to get you here. Things we like to forget. We became whoever we needed to be. I'm a buddy, completely stone cold nigga. But who we are now, the choices we make now, maybe that's all that matters. My mom once told me that the only thing more dangerous than the dead is the living. Mom. But without the living, we might as well be dead. We all need people we can count on. And that's not just about words, but action. Having the strength to put someone else's life ahead of your own. If we're willing to do that, then maybe we can get back some piece of what we've lost. The only thing I've ever known is to fight. There's so much we've done, so much more to do. But I wanna believe there's hope. That together there's hope, isn't there? The world is dark and broken, but we're not, not yet. We stare into the face of death every day. And so one day, that face is our own. How do you come back from that? Keep it. It'll help you find your way. My dad wanted mercy to prevail over wrath. <laughs> if we lose that, we lose everything. For the longest time, we were just fighting to survive. Trying to get back what we lost. This family, my family, we would do anything to protect each other. And we're fighting now for something else, something bigger. A new beginning. But that comes with a cost. There's always a cost. I never got to know my mom, Lori. My brother Carl dreamed of a day when we'd all live together in peace. My mom, Michonne, tried to hang up her sword. My dad, Rick, was searching for mercy. And me? Well, I guess I'm a Grimes too. thinking about something my mom told me. A secret saying she used to share with my dad. It was like a good luck charm. For me and RJ too. I was afraid to say it out loud. I was afraid to say so many things out loud. But 
But we didn't know when we started this, that this would be the day everything changed forever. This isn't the future my brother wanted. Not what my mom and dad fought for. Not yet. What we're doing could help everyone. Not just us, maybe everybody everywhere. Come on. I want to be part of that. To make what my family believed in real. You're still here. You're gonna be okay. They're gonna save you. <laughs> 